Hello friends, welcome to my channel HVACR Engineers. Be professionals. Welcome friends. This video, we're going to see about the basic understand of the blow through AHU and draw through AHU. First, we see about the blow through type. Type of AHU based on the fan blower arrangement. Fan blower located upstreams of the unit, which is before the cooling coil, is called blow through system. The fan blows the air through the cooling coil before discharging them to the space being condition or to the ducting system. What is, draw through unit? Fan blower, located downstreams of the unit, which is after the cooling coil. The fan pulls the air, through the mixing box, filters, and, cooling coil, before discharging it from, the fan outlet to the space to be conditioned, or, to the ducting network. Blow through, fan coil units usually, low static units. Draw through, fan coil units usually, high static units. Advantages of, blow through unit? In this arrangement, the section after the fan, has positive pressure, U-trap, is in positive pressure side. This will lead to, exhaust of air from the AHU, when U-trap is dried, especially in winter. So there is, no smell air back to unit, the motor, Heat doesn't add, to the supply air. Disadvantages of, blow through unit? Air flow, not uniform across the cooling coil, some moisture may travel, through with supply air. Due to more turbulence, temperature, and, heat transfer on the overall surface of coil is, not even. In this system, air containing moisture, can skip to the space. This problem, can be completely eliminated, if we provide sufficient space, between the fan, and, the coil. Space to increase, between the fan, and the coil, in order to provide, better airflow pattern across coil. AHU length will increase, because of increased plenum length. Initial cost, of AHU is high, because of increased AHU length. But operating cost, will be less than draw through system. Advantages of, draw through unit? Uniform airflow across the coil surface, so consistent, and, uniform heat transfer. Flow pattern is evenly distributed, in case of draw through AHU, because air is, drawn properly through the coil surface area. Even temperature on coil surface. Where, there is a space constraint, draw through AHU, will be the best choice. In draw through system, fan is after the cooling coil. This fan heat, removes some moisture contained by air. So this is, a beneficial point in draw through AHU. Draw through AHUs can be used anywhere to control the temperature and humidity of the space. Initial cost of AHU is less compared to blow through system. Disadvantages of draw through unit? In draw through AHU, the U trap is in negative pressure side. This will lead to smell air back into the AHU when U trap is dried. Which type of, system configuration is best? Draw through AHU, will be the best choice, where there is a space constraint. Draw through AHUs, can be used anywhere, to control the temperature, and humidity of the space. Initial cost of, draw through AHU is less. Thank you all. Please like and comment the videos. Share my channel with your friends. Subscribe my channel for more updated videos. Thank you see you next video.